Hey guys, Ember here with a quick tip on how to make gold on Wrath Classic. Firstly, you're going to want to have downloaded the Auctioneer mod, which you can download with the link down below in the description. Now that we have Auctioneer, we're going to want to scan the auction house. Now there's a slow and there's a fast scan. These basically pull down all of the information about all of the items that are currently stored on the auction house, all their prices and quantities and everything. Now that the scan's completed, what you're going to want to do is come up here to the top left and right click this button. Then you want to go to the vendor section because what we're going to be doing is we're going to be looking for all of the items on the auction house that are uploaded for a price cheaper that we can sell them for at vendors. Firstly, what you're going to want to do is make sure that allow buyouts is selected and allow bids is unselected, then click search. That will bring you to this list, which will show you all of the items that currently have a buyout price that is cheaper than the vendor price. So these are all of the items that you can buy now and make a profit from. As you can see by the item that I have selected here, the item currently has a buyout price of 76 silver and 50 copper, and I can sell that item to a vendor for 13 silver and 50 copper profit. Now what you want to do is go through all of these items and click buy out at the bottom. So right here, you want to click this for as many items that you can afford. Sometimes some of the auctions will have already been purchased. Um, that's just something that you can't really avoid, but the majority of them you'll be able to pick up and sell for a profit. Now let's take a look at bids. So what we want to do is unselect buyout and select allow bids. We'll expand this. I usually set it to less than 30 minutes if I want quick bids. And as you can see here, we have a list. Uh, it's not a huge list, but these are all the auctions that are ending within 30 minutes. So there's a lot of rune cloth. And as you can see here, we can buy this for five copper and sell it for 79 silver, 95 copper profit. So much like the buyout, we want to go down here and click bid. And we just want to bid on all of these. Like the buyouts as well, some of these bids and some of these auctions might have already been placed, so you might miss out on a few. But yeah, we'll, we'll bid on some of these and then we'll expand this again. We'll raise the time to two hours and see what we get. Usually with the longer bids, you have a lot more potential to make more profit. Like as you can see up here, we've got 299 profit here and 538 profit here. Obviously these bids are likely to be taken over by the time that the auction ends, but you might get lucky. Now that we've placed all our bids and we've purchased all our items, let's go and empty out our mailbox. As you can see here, we've got quite a few items. And then all you have to do now is go over, sell them to the vendor and you'll make profit. I think in this video, I made around four gold profit, which it's not, amazing it's not game breaking but it's definitely profit there and it's great profit at low levels thank you very much for watching guys hopefully this was informative and a little bit helpful for you if you're a new player starting out this will definitely help you get your first mount it will get you your training and anything that you need as a starting out character if you enjoyed this video or it helped you out in any way, don't forget to leave a like, a subscribe, smash the bell to get notified whenever I upload content or go live on YouTube. I've been doing a lot of streams recently, leveling up my Protection Warrior through Wrath Classic pre-patch. It's been awesome. Hope to see you there.